Tip number three, use plus sign as a prefix of all your power net names. And I didn't come up with this idea, I learned it. I learned it from reference designs done by Intel, AMD and all these huge companies. They use it and I found it very, very useful. How this can be useful? How, how it looks when you use it in designs? What do you think? I'm going to show you. This is a page for processor power and here you can see all the power nets, they start with the plus. And yes, maybe in the schematic it's, it's not so necessary, but it's very, very important for PCB layout. Because, why? Do you know why? Because the power nets, they are special. Power nets, they usually need to carry higher currents and uh, power nets usually need to be routed by wider tracks and you may want to use polygons on power nets. And if you have a schematic like this with plenty power nets, it's very easy to, you know, miss a power net. If I don't use plus here, how I'm going to know during the layout that it is a power net? Yeah. So just use the plus sign, go to PCB and every time you see the plus, you know it's a power net. You know you need to use white tracks, you need to use polygons to connect this net. For example, I, I'm, I'm I will show you a couple of examples like this one here yeah? or this one or this one very nicely you can see if all the tracks are white and uh, in this design <laughs> there is another tip it will be later even if you don't use plus you Im immediately see it's a power net because there is also the voltage <laughs> but as i said that's another tip if you use the plus sign, you can also very simply order the nets. So if you would like to see all the power nets, you just order the nets by name and all the power nets will be on the beginning or on the end of the list, depends how you order them. And uh, another advantage which uh, you can use is that you can very simply create rules for all, for all the power nets. So for example, you can make a rule that uh, which will be checking that if all the power nets have required minimum width, like this one. The best is to show an example always. This is 28 pins design. If you go to design rules, there is this special rule for the width which says that all the power nets, all the nets which starts with a plus sign, or if it's ground, they uh, need to have minimum width at least 0.4 millimeter. Yeah, all the other nets, they can have minimum width 0.15, but all the power nets, the minimum width is 0.4. So if you if you start all the power nets with the plus, you can very simply create this kind of rule. Let's make a summary so you don't forget. Why we would like to use plus sign? Because plus sign on the power nets. Because it's a very simple way to identify power nets, especially in the layout. Because it makes it simple to filter or order the power nets and it's very simple to use them in the rules. Don't forget use plus sign as a prefix of all your power net names.